Yesterday I told you I think that we made a mistake Cause you and I we lost our sight It's all about giving Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. In today's video, we are going to be tackling tons of cleaning and we're also going to be taking down all of the Valentine's decorations so we can get ready to decorate for Easter. And I really hope that this video gives you all tons of motivation today. If you are new here, welcome. My name is Sarah and I love making tons of shop with me videos, home decor, seasonal decor, and the occasional cleaning video. So if that is stuff that you are interested in, I would love for you to join my YouTube family by hitting that subscription button down below. And we're gonna go ahead and dive right on into all of the motivation today. We're getting started in my bedroom. I wanted to go ahead and get my bed made. And if you were here for the decorating video, you might notice that I don't have my Valentine sheets on in this video. So I'm not going to be taking those off. I had already changed out my sheets a couple days before I filmed. So it wasn't quite yet time to change out my sheets. So I'm just going to make the bed and we're going to go ahead and get everything nice and dusted and get all of those Valentine's decorations put away. And here is a quick before and after before we head on into the living room to start tackling everything in there. And it just always feels so nice once the room is nicely clean and everything is put back together. I did leave the pink throw pillows on my bed because I will be using those with my spring decorations. And now we're moving on into the living room. There were lots of blankets and snacks scattered around as always. So we're just going to go ahead and get all of that taken care of and take down the decorations in here.
Pickles has absolutely destroyed her scratching post over here. So I'm just going to go ahead and vacuum up all the carpet and then all of the little shreds from the scratching post. I'm going to go ahead and trim those off. That way I don't have to worry about her trying to eat them. And I do definitely need to replace the scratching post very soon, but she is super picky about them and she only likes the ones that have the longer carpet on them. And I have not been able to find any of them. So as soon as I find a new one for her, I will definitely be grabbing it.
Alright, now we are moving into the entryway and dining room area. I didn't have a whole lot of stuff in the entryway, so it was very quick to just grab everything off of there. I'm leaving the pink pillow because I'm going to reuse it for spring. And then we're going to take down the tiered tray and the coffee bar. And it is finally time to say goodbye to the tree that I've had in the dining room. I did decorate the Christmas tree for Christmas and for Valentine's Day and I decided that it was time to go ahead and take it down. So we are going to do that today and I am going to leave a link in the description box down below to the storage bags that I love for my Christmas trees. I am sure that everybody pretty much already has everything that they need for storage in terms of Christmas decorations at this point, but I did want to go ahead and leave that link just in case anyone is doing some organizing or maybe you just need a new tree bag. I thought that I would link the ones below that I use.
as soon as I finish wiping down this table again, we're going to move on into the kitchen to get everything taken care of in here. And the reason I didn't end up putting the table back where it's supposed to be is because I am going to be doing a very good vacuum and steam clean of all of the floors as soon as I finish cleaning the kitchen. And I didn't see reason to fix the table just to move it again so I can clean the floors. But my floors were very dirty on this day. They needed such a good cleaning that I actually ended up steaming all of them twice. I only filmed once to put in the video and then I turned the camera off and steam cleaned the areas again I went through three different steam pads actually I think it might have been four steam pads to do the dining room kitchen entryway and then the walkway in front of the island and then I also did my bathroom it was like one steam pad front and back for each little section it was so dirty so nasty definitely way past due and I am so so happy that it is taken care of now
Is there anything more satisfying to look at than a completely clean and spotless kitchen with no dirty dishes, nothing sitting on the countertops, everything just nice and clean. I just absolutely love it, but I always hate the process of actually cleaning it. And now that that is all done, we are moving on into my bathroom now. I had tons of stuff scattered around on my counter and are we really surprised? It always looks like this. So I wanted to go ahead and get that taken care of. We're gonna get everything nice and clean. And of course, we are also going to be steaming the floors in here as well. They especially needed it in here because I do have the cat's litter box in my bathroom and they get litter all over the place and it just makes a mess. So I definitely wanted to make sure I did a nice cleaning of the floors in here as well. Everybody's singing oh, everybody's singing oh I don't know what it is about you It must be in the way you move Just say you want me to, we got nothing to lose You're looking so old, you're looking so old Now I'm moving closer to you it's getting dark in this room Tell me what you wanna do Baby, let me love you, let me love you Let me love you, let me love you Baby, let me love you, let me love you Let me love, let me love Baby, let me love you Just say the word and we can leave this place Take you any way you want As long as we're together Everything will do You got me going all You got me going all Now I'm moving closer to you And it's getting dark in this room Tell me what you want to do Baby, let me love It's almost like you make me fly 
When I look at you smile, I don't know how, but it feels like I'm drunk on you. It feels like I'm drunk on you. It feels like I'm drunk on you. And that is going to be all for today's video. I really hope that this video gave you all tons of motivation today and I hope you enjoyed watching. If you did, be sure to give it a big thumbs up and don't forget to hit that subscription button down below to join my YouTube family. I would love to have you a part of it. I hope that you all have a great day and a great week and I will see you all on Thursday when we decorate for spring and Easter for 2023.